Hi, this is Kaylee from the product team at Packback. This video shows the experience that a professor will have when setting up Packback LTI integration in a new course on D2L. Note, this video assumes that Packback has already been added as an available LTI tool at the university level. If that's not yet the case at your school and you'd like to learn more about how to make that possible, we have another video called Introduction to LTI that explains the process of how to get Packback set up as an available LTI tool at your institution. To enable Packback in your course as a professor, open up the course where you'd like to use Packback. Then click Content. From here, click Add Existing Activities. Scroll down and select third-party integration. If your institution has enabled Packback as a tool that can be displayed in the navigation bar for a course, you should see Packback as an available tool from the drop-down menu. If you do not see Packback available, you may need to contact your school's IT department and ask them to enable Packback in your course. If you need any assistance, please contact our team at engineering at packback.co. Once you click Packback, you'll immediately see Packback questions appear on your homepage for your course. You can drag the newly created link anywhere you'd like on your course's homepage. All it takes to finish setting up Packback from here is to click the Packback Questions link and follow the instructions shown within Packback. In our next video, we'll walk you through the experience that professors see when first launching the Packback LTI integration and the different options you can select from as an existing Packback user or a brand new Packback user. 